Now this is the cross eyes, it's the snake head swim jig. And really, the head design is very similar to that of a snake. Um, also, as you can see, the line tie is vertical on it, on the flipping jig. It's a flat line tie on this one, it's vertical. And that's so it really comes through that water. It snakes through all that cover. Uh, doesn't get hung up on it. This is a jig that I'm gonna use really in a cast and retrieve situation. So, uh, lily pad stalks, grass, uh, bushes, whatever it might be, when you have a lot of that little standing cover, this thing is gonna come right through there. Basically cast it out, reel it back in. Still has a heavier wire on it, and that's because for the most time, I'm gonna use braided line on this. And if you've got a light wire on that swim jig and you use braided line, you're gonna get your feelings hurt because that hook's gonna open up. Uh, the holder on this one is a little bit different, as you can see. This one right here has a molded in hook holder. So this, uh, the keeper on the hook is made to hold those plastics in place because it really has all that surface area as opposed to one wire on there. So with a swim jig, I'm making really hard casts, fishing a long ways, jerking it on that braid. So I want something that's gonna keep that bait in place. Um, slide the elastic right over top of that and it's gonna stay put.